This is a follow-up to a class and I'm seeing a couple of things that I'm not able to explain. Uh, the one is that the pattern that's used in this rig is uh, 8 feet by 4 feet and if I change that to say 10 feet you'll see that the uh, it is actually uh, using the formula um, and I can see the values in here. So what I'm not understanding is if I put this back to 8 feet again um, why is there a difference of a, th a one thirty second of an inch in the actual dimension it's shown now? So that, that, that's one issue. The other issue is as I work on this, the technique that I was using was to was to place points uh, on the reference lines, and then I would select the points and uh, change their their properties so that I can say. Um, uh, always display them and don't just show the normal. The The issue that I have is that when I place a point, uh, so if I set the set the plane that I'm drafting on, and I place a point, I get, I get that message which I expect. I, I know it's gone away in the 2012. If I tab through here and I select, you can see that the Z direction is down the way. But if I do the same thing on the other side here, so if I tab to if, if I um, if I tab to select my plane that I'm drafting on or use the set uh, there and place my point, I get the message. And then when I pick on that point, you see that the Z is up the way. So my my way around this to fix it was to was to have a parameter called rig height and really what I'm doing is just using a, a formula with a minus in front of it to assign two different parameters to the two different points but uh, something I mean that's that's confusing me so if there's an answer to why that should be working that way I would, I would love to hear it thanks a lot